Alrighty, welcome in everybody to the newest episode in our uh, Old World playthrough here for the Sacred and the Profane. Um, now, right away, we're starting in with the uh, newest turn, indicating that we are one turn away from our queen dying. Now, guys, forgive me. This is like the fourth time I've tried to record this episode. I've had a new mic. I don't know. I've had, you know, uh, just recording issues kind of all together. And so it's just been a bit of a struggle so i'm going to be uh what may seem like flying through decisions because it's like the fifth time that i've been making these decisions uh and yeah and so if if i don't give you know thorough explanation and if i'm not reading through it i hope you'll forgive me that will continue in the next episode uh and it will continue you know just making more sense as we go through but for now i'm trying to you know just kind of get through this make sure that we have everything uh taken care of that we need to have uh get taken care of so that you guys can have a video today um and and have something to, to actually watch so i i am very sorry for the struggle that i've been you know going through here i hope that you'll forgive me in the, in the future videos i'll be a little bit better towards what what needs to happen so let's go ahead and uh continue onward here um and just really progressing in our uh, game. So. Up, up. Next turn, we'll get a kill there. Um, we'll take my scout, we'll go harvest some goats, we'll come this way, we'll head towards the silver. Um, all of my workers are already going in. I don't really have anybody else that I can move. We'll go to the next turn. Alrighty, my militia is going to take a nasty hit here from getting hit from behind and getting flanked. I got the Fountainhead as my new Cognomen. Um, unfortunately, I died. Uh, so they now have Legacy Ambitions, which means I need to work on getting my Miners. And my Granaries and Mounted Units is going to be very difficult. Um, and then I have a bunch of events that are happening down here. I'm going to choose Rhetoric because I think that it's the, the best option. I'm going to choose a new Governor, which is going to be Cohen. Um, and then I have this uh, worker opening up here. I'm going to come down, uh, start a quarry, which is 12 and a half stone per. Uh, I need a uh, worker in here. Um, I don't have anything or or I don't have a citizen yet that I can use as a, as a specialist, so I'm going to go ahead and start in on a, a treasury. Then once that treasury is finished, then I'm going to go ahead and, and put a stone cutter over here to increase that. I'm going to start in on a hamlet. After the hamlet, I'll go to a farm here, and then I'll put a granary up in here uh, for one of them. Um, let's see. I just finished a, a garrison up here, which means I can put uh, a governor in the city. I'm going to choose that one, which gives me civics as well as gold. Um, let's see. I'm going to start in on my Odeon, which is what I'm going to put here. Uh, increase my culture in that city. I'm going to retreat back my militia. I'm going to take the kill here. Uh, which I need to buy an order in order to take. Take the kill there. And I believe that I am all set for this turn. Next unit doesn't necessarily matter. I'll move to the fur and then the silver in, a, in the previous, or in the next turn. Um, I have 11 years, and so I'm going to start with a treasury um, and then maybe go into a wall or something different uh, in this city. Final favor, uh, I'm going to take the gold be charming i gain the phalanx technology which allows me to uh, train spearmen which is fantastic because they have great um combat score i built the pyramids this is going to give me legacy fantastic um i'm going to reject the zoroastrian priest from my uh, city because that's going to keep judaism in there uh and then i'm going to start a free uh, influence mission this is my second daughter uh she is a marna which means she can either be you know commander zealot scholar i'm gonna have her study uh tactics because both commander and zealot are in there um increases the chance of a good education um i also need two orders to tutor her so i'm gonna buy those uh and then i'm gonna tutor her i'm gonna tutor her with my husband that's great and then i'm gonna end here again guys sorry if i'm flying through this I'm exhausted <laughs> at recording. Um, let's see. Um, daughter's pouring over a Persian text. Culture, she can gain wisdom or legitimacy. Mm, wisdom for my daughter. She's eventually going to be the leader. This is my niece. Uh, I'm going to have her study, I believe, uh, philosophy. Yep. Mm. 
share a piece sensitive information. Dido, ruler of Carthage, is planning a diplomatic mission to Persia. When the seasons change, she will be traveling with fewer guards than usual. It's advice that we strike Dido down when she is vulnerable and frame the Persians for her murder. That would pit our enemies against each other. There's no honor in such machinations. Uh, agree, actually. Um, but let's see. Carthage goes to war with Persia. Or, I, uh, let's just... Ooh, but I... I lose cunning, which is a good strength here. So I could kill her, and those two go to war. Occupy those two for a little bit of time, which is okay, I guess. And I don't lose much relations with the two. And it doesn't say it could lead to future events, so there's not really a risk of me getting caught here. So that, you know what? Let's let's do this. Go to war! Is dead. A new ruler has taken the throne. Their opinion of you is now cautious. Ooh, so I did get a little bit of a de uh, decree there. Ooh, declares war on Persia. Nice. All right, I got to choose ambition. I'm going to choose battle. Try and kill 10 military units. Um, let's see. Try to befriend. Hmm. I'll take the minute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's get opinion here. That's good. Um, let's see. Garrison. No, I'm going to go with an Odeon first. And then I'll go to Garrison afterward. Let's see. All my workers working, they are. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Move you back here. You're gonna heal. You're gonna take a pop shot. Mm, first shot here. You upgrade it into a Highlander, which is great. Then the next turn after that, I'll replace the general. I'll take a hit and then I'll get the kill with the queen uh, as, a, as a general. Move over here, harvest over, move down here to avoid the shot. Um, and we're done. Ooh, sometimes it does this where it says, like, turn ended, and then it just kind of sits here in a loading screen. So just be patient with me while it figures itself out. I hope everyone had a wonderful weekend. I apologize for not doing uh, more videos over the weekend. I took some time to kind of relax on my own uh, and just really recharge for the week. You should have a video every day this week, though. I should be able to, to get you guys that much. Okay, let's see. My daughter lost a, lost courage. Uh, and perfect. Alrighty, I'm gonna go with the free light ca uh, chariot there. Um, I have two options here. I can come over here and I can create the Shrine of Ra, which uh, in earlier episodes says that, you know, something that I wanted to do because that would increase the yields from the uh, farms that I have over here, which is, you know, fantastic. But uh, instead, I'm going to move over here and I'm going to start creating mines. And the reason that I need to start creating mines is because I need miner specialists. So I'll go ahead and I'll do that. Uh, and then I have four citizens that I can, you know, spend something on here. So... Uh, I'll probably do like a treasury and then mines over here. When this warrior is done, I'll get a miner on the gold as well. Um, let's see. I need an additional hamlet in this city. I believe that I'm going to go ahead and put it here. The reason that I'm going to put it here is because it's adjacent to the Odeon, which will increase the productivity of the Odeon for culture. So I'll do a hamlet there. Uh, treasury still two turns out for that. You're going to go ahead and you're going to heal. Um, you're going to come down here. We need a granary. It says granary here. I'm going to put the granary here. And the reason that I'm going to do so uh, is because I'm going to put farms all around this uh, river. So the way that it'll end up happening is I'll go farm here. So it'll be farm, 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 and farm, right? So you'll have five here, all of which are adjacent to a river, which increases its, uh, its yields. And then I'll put a granary, which will be adjacent to all of them, which will increase their yields as well. And so we'll have this granary right here. Uh, and then I'm also going to have a granary right here. And those will be the, the two that I need for my uh, my legacy ambition for controlling four granaries. Um, I need to replace the general. I'm going to replace it with the queen. Choose. I'll take a hit next turn, yes. But the turn after that, I'll, or when I end my turn. But the turn, but next turn, I'll be able to kill this and have my first kill. Next unit. Alrighty, I'm gonna move over to the silver. I'm gonna go ahead and harvest that. I'm gonna move to the game, harvest that. Uh, and I'm gonna keep you. Ooh, look. We got some clams up there, I believe. Import and export. Uh, I'm gonna choose lavender. Mastering the strongest arguments, charisma or courage. I'm gonna go with charisma. I'm gonna let the heirs have their harmless fun. I'm gonna end.
take a hit. Take another hit on my scout up there. Um, perfect. Oh no! Yep, Han, heir to the Carthaginian throne, has taken his own life. In his final message, he lamented his unrequited passion. All right, I'm gonna sit and listen. I'm gonna take the kill here. Now, I wanna make sure that this uh, unit that's in the capital does not kill me. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna move my scout way over here. Way over here. Um, and then they'll take the hit from here and then I can retreat my warrior. This warrior will pop out. I'll replace the generals and make my way back up here. I'll heal. See workers working, 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 working. Perfect. Next unit is my scout. I'm gonna skip a turn with the scout. And that's going to give me 11 orders. It's going to convert into some training here. Perfect. Take the hit like I... Oh, come on. All right. Uh, the Duchess uh, takes tactics training with an unbridled enthusiasm, especially combat drills where she bests her opponents every time. Clearly, the instructions are the best in Egypt. We may wish to consider promoting some of them. Let's see, tough heckler or swift next turn, or we get a court soldier as my as uh, as a courtier. You know what? I want to keep increasing uh, my daughter's uh, traits here. Let's see, Danes present an offer, promising a stable peace. Do we approve? I lose legitimacy here. Uh, offer's not good enough. Um. Borrow money to cover their losses in the latest trade debacle. Could lead to future events. I'm going to say no. Uh, learn how to make good trades. That's, that's really the, the answer to, to that question. Let's see. Can I make another Hamlet here? I can't. So I think that the camp is the next best option. So I'm going to come over here to the camp. Go there. Um, I don't have a citizen that I can use here. It's going to be four years on that. Uh, or two years on that. I'm going to start in on the forum. When the forum completes, then I'll add a specialist, which will most likely be this trapper over here, or probably the farmer, more than likely. Uh, I'm going to create a farm right here. Uh, and what the farm will allow us to do, we'll create a granary afterward. Alrighty, I need this guy, the stone cutter. Um, let's see, get that. I think I'm going to start creating the camp here. Workers working, workers working. Here we go. I'm gonna move you here first. Upgrade you into a spearman. Move you back. Let's see. Move you back here. I'm going to replace the general here to the duke. And then I will heal this this up, and once I get to full health here, that is when I will upgrade to a spearman because you can't upgrade it not to full health. I have two options that I can do here. I can create a treasury or a forum or walls, right? I, I could do some sort of project, which would be good because my governor can hurry projects with gold. So I could go ahead and I could do that, or I could start getting work on a worker. Um, and I have a lot of citizens that can be used here, right? I have four. So I think I'm going to, to do that. I'm going to do a, a, a worker first. And I believe that that is everything. So we'll go ahead and we'll end our turn there. All right. She has become a heckler, which is a strength, apparently. As a general, 25% combat. As a leader, 10%. Uh, Oh, but that's all versus a general. Okay. Yeah, that's only just okay. All right. Our heir gained back the courage that she lost, or gained some charisma, which is great. She has five charisma. That's wonderful. All righty. Um, this warrior, you know what? Let's figure out the builder first. We wanted a garrison, so let's do the, the garrison down here. There we go. I need the miner. This is going to give us the second miner of our legacy ambition. Um, we have the worker in there. We're going to heal. We're going to move you. We're going to add a general, which is going to be the queen. Mm. Or 
in one year is a free light chariot. So rather than the queen, let's just go ahead and spend that 100 on a promotion instead. Uh, let's see, from trees. That's a good one. Yeah, let's do a ranger for a promotion there. We'll move this warrior to here. We'll upgrade it into a spearman. We'll start our granary here. Um, let's see. We can do walls, festival, council. I think that we're going to do a forum because it's only going to take us five years to complete there. So let's do a forum. And I believe that the only other thing that we have... Unfortunately, we lost our scout. We may need to consider training another scout, maybe in the capital or something along those lines. It's really unlucky. Uh, militia is the one that hasn't moved, so I'll move the militia up here, and we'll call it good there. All righty. Go the aristocracy. We're gonna start in on a miner here, which is gonna take us three turns. I'm going to create another mine here. Um, I need, with this worker, I need to build an Odeon. So the question is where to build the Odeon. I can build an Odeon up here next, or right here even. I think that's what I'm going to do. Build that right there. I'm going to heal you up. I'm going to take you, move you to here, add a general, which is going to be the queen, because you're going to kill the most. I believe. We'll move you here. We'll move you here. We've healed you up. Move you in this direction. Let's see. Worker, worker, worker. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Alrighty. I think that we are all set there. I have important decisions to make. We'll definitely make decisions. I'm going to convert them to Judaism. Let's see. She has wisdom, which is great. I'm going to make her a scholar, which is great. I'm going to end my turn. I'm now known as the Mason. Fantastic. My daughter is, a fam is famed as a carpenter. That's fantastic. That's going to give me... Uh, New siege and ship units gonna have XP. Cool. Uh, my courtier died. My daughter's doing great. Uh, courage, charisma, wisdom, discipline. Courage, charisma. Yep, courage, charisma. Let's see. For most of marriage between you and Kamos, uh, I already have a husband, so. No. We will continue to use slaves. Let's see. Scouts report increased activity along the nation's borders. We soon learn why. King Hattisili, the beloved, the ruler of, ha of, of, Hat of Haiti, Hatti, has been assassinated by members of his own council. The news has yet to reach the public, so we still have a chance to use it to our advantage. We can energize our troops and generals. We can honor him with a heartfelt speech, which will increase my charisma, which is, I mean, which is great, because I, I mean, I have three. Or uh, I can... Keep the assassination in secret for now, which gains, gives me more wisdom, which is more science. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. It also gives a light chariot that's trained in my capital, plus 7% crit chance, which is fantastic because that's what I have. Okay, I'm going to move up here. I'm going to bop you on the head. Uh, I'm going to move up here. I'm going to take the kill with my queen. Perfect. Uh, I could do courage. I could do wisdom. Or charisma. Let's see. My light chariot gets more crit here. Gets more defense here. Charisma's good. And courage is good. Attack power. More crit is just always good, right? Like, yeah, let's let's go with crit. Uh, my militia. I actually don't really care too much. I'm gonna move my militia here. I'm asleep. That way, you can kind of defend that city. I'm gonna go with a farmer, like I said that I was gonna do. I could go up here with a miner. Uh, to complete my legacy. I don't really want to. 
uh, because I'm going to complete it over here anyway. Right, I have one going here, one going here. The, the last one will go up here of, of what I need. This guy completed the camp. Um, I can come up. I could come up here and do a quarry, which is a good quarry. Um, however, I think that I'm going to... You know what? Actually, that's probably the best move. I have a garrison, which means that I need to appoint a governor here. Um, I think that I'm going to do... My king consort. Yep. He's going to be the governor of that city. I'm going to move this worker over to create a camp on the elephants. The theater is a really good option. Being adjacent to both hamlets uh, gives us a bunch of culture. Yeah, let's do that. Theater. Why can't I do it? Because I don't have an order. Let's buy an order. Let's get my theater. Oh, I'm really low on orders, but I'm also really low on training, so I can't buy anymore. We'll just have to continue kind of uh, without using those orders, unfortunately. Able to give a rousing speech on demand. She is inspiring. Look at her go. Fantastic. Thank you. All righty. Now, this is going to be an interesting decision. I believe that getting spoked wheel so that we can train chariots is a, is a pretty good idea. But let's take a look at what chariots really lead us to from the spoked wheel technology. Where is it? It's right here. It leads us to being able to give, get portcullis, which allows um, the creation of moats as well as a spy master. That's really good. It also leads to stirrups, which is all my mounted units here. So that's really, really good. Land consolidation allows me to create groves as well as a bunch of other uh, mounted units like uh, camel archers and war elephants. And we know that we have elephants, uh, you know, abounding. So let's see. Sorry. Let's see. Hmm. Or we could do doctrine. Doctrine opens up the temple. We know that we do like doctrine, right? Because we do need to build temples with our Jewish disciple. I still think the best option is going to be... Mm. It's either land consolidation or spoked wheel. I'm going to do land consolidation because I already have a chariot. I've pretty much given up on the five mounted units, right? I only have 12 years left to do it. So let's, let's go ahead and do land consolidation. Uh, I'm going to hit here, take the kill here, get my second one. Perfect. Heal you up. I'm going to make sure all my workers are are able to do what they need to. Here's my last granary that I need to complete. Uh, you're going to move over here, start up on this camp. Um, let's see. You're idle. So let's see. You can do a, a, a project here. We could do either walls or a forum. I'm going to do... Mm, yeah, let's do forum. You're working, you're working, you're working. Perfect. Everybody's working where they need to be. I'm going to move the spearmen in this direction here. I'm going to add a general. This is a, yeah, great option here for a general. Add a general there. Tactic studies, let's see. She can gain tactician, which will allow her to serve as a general or a spy master or a zealot. Okay, we'll do that one. We'll end our year here. Looks like we need to uh, appoint an ambassador as well. Okay, gain discipline in our duke. Alrighty, we are going to create a farm over here. We don't have any citizens that we can use. Six years until we get one. Let's go ahead and build walls. The walls are going to help protect us from any raids that we get from these uh, Numidians that are close to our border. So we're going to start in on that. Um, and I'm going to head in this direction first here. I'm going to step up. Bop you on the forehead here. Step up. 
stop you as well. Uh, I need to get going on a uh, settler. I'll get going on a settler. And, the, and while I get going on a settler, I will take this and move it up here and settle this coastal region with all of these Boolean, resor uh, Boolean resources, um, which will be fantastic for me. And then with these eight orders, I'm actually going to take this Jewish disciple here, and I am going to create temples in other cities. So let's see... Where's a good place to put this? You know what? I'm going to put it right here. Create a monastery. And then my uh, my Shrine of Ra will go here when, when this is finished. Okay, all of my workers are doing everything that they need to be doing. unit. Let's finish the healing there. Lord. Nope, I want to stay at war. I'm not going to take peace. Alrighty. Now I do not technically need this uh, this third uh, mine at all, so I'm going to move over here. I'm going to create the shrine of Ra, which I said I was going to create, um, and then let's see. A quarry is really good. That's going to get me some stone. Um, is anything else come at more importance? I don't think so. So let's go ahead and get the quarry going. Um, this is idle. Let's see. We have a garrison. I think that we're going to take these three trees right here and create our lumber mills. So let's get ahead, uh, go ahead and get started there. We are in desperate need of, of wood income. Uh, and then we've got the miner. We have two years until we have a citizen that we can use. So let's get started on a treasury here. Get some gold going. This worker needs to get started on something. Let's see. I think this is where we said that we were gonna do the shrine of uh, Osiris. So let's go ahead and get started on that. Um, we need our farmer specialist. And we're going to, we only have one order, which is fine because we're just gonna go ahead and we're gonna take the scale here. Uh, I gained legitimacy from enslaving a tribe, enslaving, <laughs> enslaving a tribal chief. I can uh, gain more charisma by sparing them, but killing the father and cheese and rice. Um, or I can adopt a tribal prince. Hmm. Send them both away in chains. In chains. Uh, jeez. I think what I need to do is buy and move this guy away. There are three individuals here that that, that want to jump jump me, and I don't want to be a part of that. I want no part of that. Alrighty, looks like we have another turn ended, thinking taking its time. Hmm. I wonder why it does this. It doesn't happen all the time, but it, I mean, this is the first time that it's happened so much in one recording. Not much that I could really do uh, about it. So while that is thinking, let's see what our plans are. So we got our lumber mills that we're doing here. Once land consolidation is finished, I do want to improve this grove. And the importance of this, uh, this uh, lavender here, is once improved and I put a specialist on this lavender, I can send the lavender uh, to one of these families, which will increase their opinion. You can see that each one of these families have required... Um, luxuries that they that they want right having them increases your uh opinion of those families or those families opinion of you um i mean these 
these pastures are fantastic for us, right? Having these pastures is going to increase our growth in the city, but we really do want to take advantage of these farms as well. I don't see any reason not to take advantage of them. So we're going to continue on the farms of, uh, of this city as well. Um, this family needs uh, urban specialists. So on our next specialist, we may uh, have to do this one. because that's where the benefits of that family are. Let's see. The Gauls have converted to Zoroastrianism, decreasing their opinion of us. Oh, bummer. Um, and then the general here died in the field. Unfortunate. Uh, these guys chased me. I'm going to move on back into my city. I'm going to heal. Uh, I'm going to move him over here to hold the site. Mm, let's see. Actually, let's do this. Let's bop you. We'll move you. We'll take you down here. We'll get the kill. That's five. Now, I don't believe... Yep, you won't be able to kill my spearman, which is fantastic. Uh, my worker is done on this uh, camp here. So I could move to do another farm, which is what I'm going to do. So I'm going to go ahead and create a farm there. Um, let's see. I have one specialist that I can send out here, and I have a bunch of things that I can choose from here. So let's first take a look at this. Uh, let's see. I can build urban improvements on sand. Uh, minus 50% production time for disciple units, right? Let's see. If the, is this monk a disciple unit? No, he's a specialist. Specialist. Four, two. I think I'm going to go with the apprentice monk. I think that that's... The, the best use that we can have of that citizen slot. We're good with both of our builders. We're going to take you. We are going to upgrade you to a spearman since you're fully healed now. And I believe we are going to... Um, we're going to sleep. Once the settler is finished, we'll move him up next turn uh, to, to settle that location. There's just a lot of things to, to really get improved over here that would really benefit us. All righty. And I believe that that's everything. Um, and uh, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to end the episode there. Thank you guys for watching and continuing to follow along with this series. I really appreciate it. It's been an exciting time for me to really start on this YouTube journey, something that I've really wanted to do for a while. So I'm going to go ahead and keep the, the videos coming. Hopefully you guys like them. If you do like them, feel free to drop a like. I would definitely appreciate a subscribe, but no pressure there. Uh, and I, uh, hope that you guys have a you know a wonderful week and let's you know let's continue on this journey together thanks guys